Hello there, Internet Dwellers. Welcome back to another video. Today, we are basically finishing off the series of the instant logs by Reach Animations. I've done it in a very, very strange order. I basically started off on the third season, went back to the first season, and now I'm finished on the second season. Yeah, the second season so far has been really, really good. And it's been about Enad. Uh, the first season was about Enad, like killing people. And I think the second season, he was kind of caught and shut down, I believe. I'm not sure. But from the looks of things, I don't think it's really worked here. This is a 26 minute episode. So, you know, go get your popcorn or your, your tea or whatever. And we're just going to have a nice cozy relaxation. Well, as relaxing as it can be. Go subscribe to Reach Animations. Let's jump into this. August 3rd, 1983. You can sing. No. Testing, testing. One, two, three. All right. Adrian Crawford. This is Ward 6 of the Ashton and Emily case. William Ashton has been identified at this time okay. as a highly dangerous individual. So they've caught him. They know it's him. By the Federal Bureau of Investigation. It's wanted by the FBI. Ashton is currently being charged with four counts of murder. Mm -hmm. Any and all witnesses or employees have been detained for safety purposes, as well as for suspected involvement or correlation with William Ashton. Interesting. Upon interviewing the employees, Henry Emily has been cleared of suspicion and has in fact shown us in full scale the damage caused by Ashton. Thus is Nick Scoots. As of now, any and all animatronic or robotic entities contained within the location are being decommissioned and okay. the site will be completely locked down. So they any know that... Of entities within all will be dealt with by force. Ah, so it's going to be like After SCP. The with Mr. Emily and the site staff, it was concluded there were four active animatronics. Mm hmm. Uh, these included Funtime Freddy, Funtime Foxy. I mean, it's kind of uh, weird to, to think about, like, something as cuddly as that these names are. Like, something like this actually happening, and a guy having to read these names out loud. And say, yeah, these things are very dangerous. It's like it's like n if you named a robot Mr. Mittens, and it goes around like decapitating people, and you still know it as Mr. Mittens. Aurora and the circus baby. After they had been contained, we were advised to keep cautious for the anomaly. Mm. Based on the logs Mr. Emily showed me, it appears to be a poorly constructed animatronic frame with basic programming to kill. Damn. It is suspected to be created by Ashton. See, Baby was just like to lure, you know, it's, it's shady. At least it has a nice face, you know. It looks aesthetically pleasing for a child to approach. Enad literally looks like something that's been shat out of like a, a freaking workshop. I was thought it was fast, vicious, and extremely dangerous. Mm. But based on the evidence I've seen, I doubt it will be able to handle an attack. It is still recommended to stay cautious as we don't truly know everything about it. Okay. The operation will commence in two days. Two days? And light military assistance has been requested in case of a large scale attack. Damn. Log. African doing an invasion on the uh, sister location. August 4th, 1983. Psychological analysis. Patient, Clark Williams. Psychologist, James Harvey. Begin audio log? Yeah, baby. Oh, no photograph available for these guys. They're just avatars. Hello, Clark. Take a seat. Who was Clark again? So, Clark, I've heard a lot about you. Your job your family, and some other things. So first of all, I want to know how you feel right now. How have you been lately? Not, not good. Not, not good. <laughs> Hang on. Am I being an idiot? No, okay. Very bad. Is he, is he a, a, like a police I'm officer, detective? That, Luckily, I am here to help you. If you will allow me, 
I would like to dive deeper into this bad stuff. Okay? Uh, okay. Okay. A couple of months ago, you had what some would describe a traumatic event, yeah? Okay, so it's going to go... This is like after whatever happened has happened. Involving the death of one of your co-workers? Hmm. <clears throat> uh, yeah. Okay. Would you care to explain that, Clark? I need you to open up. The floor is yours. Take your time. Okay. Tim. Uh, Tim. So happened. Oh, and okay. There, he, he was. He, he died. The, the, I, 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 I don't know how. And I, I think, was this guy the guy that rang up the engineer guy? I think. And, and then, yeah. Tim was the guy who died in the. Uh, Elevator shaft, I think. It was, it was murder. It was, it was scary. I'm not quite, I'm not quite catching on. Tim was murdered. Do you know who did it? No. It was a big robot. No. That, that, that thing just did it. That, 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 that's what Adrian told me. Describe the thing to me. Yes. He had, what, my teeth, right eyes. A clown face, yeah, I can think about it. He does have a clown face. Clown, clown face. He was a nightmare. Mm -hmm. <laughs> It's good acting. It's okay, Clark. Sorry, I shouldn't laugh at that. No. Come, my friend. And I got away. Oh, Survivor Girl. It's a monster. A monster. A monster. Yeah, that would be terrifying, to be fair. Now that I think about it. He's like seven feet tall, wasn't it? Damn. Three months earlier. Well, it's one month, actually, wasn't it? Okay. How you know you could if you've got the chance to talk at least say how you that's gonna happen because I have no idea. Oh, okay. A SWAT unit's going in. Unit so what? Ten twenty-three. Now arriving on site. Right, there's a whole ass freaking squad going in. Well, I'm not surprised. This thing's like a freaking monster. Affirmative. Affirmative. Move out. Ten four. Stand clear for bay doors. Okay, this is pretty cool. See, this is this is what we need. I've. Never seen a squat SWAT team go in for Freddy and his friends. Or an ad. The anomaly. This is very good. Damn. Hey, more major. Are those, like, head cams? You know what it reminds me of? It reminds me of the first Resident Evil game. Where you see, uh, they, they've all got their head cams on. And then one, like, gets eaten by a dog, I think. And then they run to that mansion. Super dope. Over here! Sure. What? A band! Perfect. <laughs> That's very out. sus! Shut up, Ryan. Oh, are they putting their cameras down into the vents? 
78%. They could have at least charged these batteries up before going in on a operation. Oh, they're in a, like an RC car. I mean, a RC, whatever. All right. It's very good. Oh dear, what? What is that? Oh. I don't like like the. Oh, that's not nice. My God. <laughs> My God. Unit two to dispatch. We've located the anomaly. Our rover is currently active but has it on the main camera. It's through the main gallery vent. Oh dear. Check the maintenance tunnels. You should be able to reach that point from there. See you off the vent as well. Affirmative. Let's move. The battery's going down pretty quickly. Oh, God. <laughs> Sweet we mother of Jesus. Visibility is low. Redirection comes to Detective Crawford. Affirmative. 10 1. This is Unit 4. Adrian, do you copy? Adrian. Where are we going, Crawford? <laughs> Where are we going, Crawford? Wait, are they? I don't, this hallway's a little bit narrow to be saying, like, all right, go guns blazing. Uh, unless they're side by side. How many people are in this squad, for one? Is it just the two of them? They should really be side by side. Ah. Woo! I thought I saw something. But it's just the cursor. You are only advancing to your death. The mistake you are making will cost you lives. So where's William in all this? I'm guessing maybe he doesn't get... He's on the run, right? On the run, building some freaking... Killing robots. Do it. Your grave. I don't think bullets are really going to affect this thing, is it? Negative. Three. Footsteps. Adrian, check the hallway camera. What is it? Oh, it's fun time, Foxy. Wow. <laughs> oh, that's not uh, terrifying at all. No. Wait. Hello there. It's <laughs> every cop after a traffic stop. Jesus. Ten four. Not every cop, guys. That was a joke. Okay. Right. So he's gone. He dead. 
Okay. I think we can do. Oh, that's haunting. You okay? <laughs> Adrian, what's outside that door? Uh oh. Lydia! Deploying flash! Deploying flash? What are you shooting at? It's gone. Damn it! You didn't want to dispatch. We have suffered by no casualties. <laughs> Unit four seven. Requesting additional temperature. <laughs> it would be hilarious if he threw the flashbang and it bounced off the wall and it just blinded him. <laughs> he just fires like uncontrollably at the rest of his team. Does anyone read me? You're on your own. own. Comes up and cut out. Adrian, do you copy? Oh dear. Yeah, tr what does that Nothing. say? Well, no. We hold our ground and wait for a reinforcement. I have. Be prepared to make a final stand if need be. Understood. Final stand. Understood. You're willing to die for this? You guys think they're alright? Their only hope. Tom's being cut is in a good direction, though. Right before they cut out, they said they found the target. Seriously? How do you know? I'm on the dispatch channel. They ran through that to Texas Channel for guidance to the facility, and we have yet to hear back from them. Mmm, yes, yes. They only have so long. If I'm not careful, this may will run out of fuel. They just... Why yeah. is there a helicopter? The force is too dense, and we're too far from that. Well, all we can do is wait. Adrian, I'm sorry. Is the second unit on standby, by any chance? Why is the helicopter just flying above Ten there? Four. Does it Has it got, like, a machine gun turret attached? Because if it's an X-Field chopper, they really shouldn't... Oh, the power's off. Uh, get up! Get up! Uh, it's Freddy! Oh, hey, kids! Hello! Hey, Freddy! Hey, kids! Hello! Uh -huh. That is a machine gun I see there. Okay. Well, I will be going now. Goodbye. Imagine something just runs now. This place is hell. We can't stay here. Oh! Man, he got behind you. Nice. <laughs> you just manhandled them. Remember the fallen. Unit 2. Cranium destruction. Unit 3. Uh, cause of death. Extreme spinal fracture. Cranium removal. Jeez, he had his head torn off. Wow. So they didn't shut down this thing then. Das ist nichts gut. None. Separation is quickly going south. I don't see why we should just pull the plug, seal the breach, and just leave that thing in there. There is no way that hunk of metal could break through a reinforced steel gate. I mean... Okay, okay, Tom's the back. This is Zulu one. Does anyone read me? What is he saying? Adrian, is that, is that you? Hello! <laughs> Welcome to your new job. Oh, oh, shit. All units operate to report. Build the gate. Remaining SWAT units. 
Close the gate. Oh god, that's terri that's such a terrifying oh, thought. Here we go. It's such a terrifying thought that a thing of that size and that ferocity is coming towards you and you need to get that closed before it gets out. Who gives a damn? Those were orders from the top! Open that panel right there! I can't close it! <laughs> Pull the lever! I can't! It won't fight! <laughs> it's frozen! I can't shut the door! I, I think the power got cut! Yeah, because I know how to do that. Alright, there should be a switch or something to unlock it so we can close it ourselves. Do you see anything over there? Yes, manual control override. Alright, let's close this shit and get out of here. Right on. <laughs> what is that? On my mark. Right on. <laughs> Sergeant, there is four people dead. You're talking like this. Your what is wrong with you? On it. Ready. Three, two, Just push! One, push! They could have got a, maybe a few more people. Critical, it's gonna crash. Go on, crash on top of it, that'll be hilarious. The anomaly escaped. <laughs> you could have sent in some better people, jeez. This is Adrian Crawford. Crawford. And this will be the last log that I make. He's gonna unalive himself? The mission has failed. And the anomaly is headed here for me and I can only assume Aston why for you I have a hand grenade with me and a loaded pistol I'm gonna eat them for lunch before I go out I'm going to lock the door pull the pin and send that bastard to hell along with myself yeah, the only problem there is that he's made of machine All parts this. You're made of flesh, so if there's a I chance do that it right, I can kill it. I'm hoping that whoever finds this recording has contact within the government. Yeah, I do. I do. I know so a few people. Tell my family. I know a few why people. I won't Don't be worry. Returning home. I'll sort you out. I'll get you a big Mac meal on the house. Okay. To my wife Melissa, my son Chris. And my daughter Charlotte, I want you all to know that I love you very much. Please forgive me. Well, Adrian, he went out like a man, or did he? Let's see what happens. Well, that is a disgusting sounding right creature. Hey there, big guy. I don't have a lot of time here, but but if your little friend Willie is watching, tell him he's gonna want in hell. He's gonna get what he deserves. Oh dear. Also, maybe maybe stop with the monologuing and just. Okay. 
It's Modius. What are you doing? Well, damn. Well, here we go. There's something at the end here. This is just the beginning. Is it, though? So, the third instant log, is that going into, like, um, something else? Okay, so this is the explosion afterwards. Okay. Oh, God. Oh, damn. Is it dead, though? So there's the original gang, Freddy, Bonnie, and Chica. It's not over. Interesting. Interesting. Well, now we've seen them all, guys. We've seen them all, and uh, that was really good, to be fair. The animation was really good. Sound design was really good. Voice acting could be a little bit... You know, I feel like they were going too heavy with the whole grunt thing. Like, oh, 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 you know what I mean? Trying to sound like really tough. I guess they are just tough people that go into the military, but you know, that's the only the only small issue that I had. The rest were fantastic. It was really cool. So congratulations to everyone who worked on this. Reach Animations, that was really cool. And I look forward to seeing the Instant Logs 3. I've already watched the first episode, obviously. And that's going back to the original gang. And it's more subtle, that one. And I like that. Um, so we'll see what happens. But yeah, there we go, guys. Be sure to go subscribe to Reach Animations. Um, leave a like rate and all that good stuff. If you enjoyed this reaction, why not leave a like rate and subscribe. And I will see you guys in the next video. Take care, guys.